ever in Orlando and you're about to get on 528, 40, 36, do not go to that place for gas. Look at their gas prices. Orlando, Florida, load number three coming off now. What do you think, my friend? These four, right? I need jail. I think I look like one. Well, I need the Dior paper. What's that? I need the Dior paper. I've had the, uh, oh, the, uh, I know. I know about that. So yeah, each time I unload one, because some of them only have one strap, so now I'm taking, so the very last one always has two. This one's got one in the center. It's pretty light. Hold them real well, but it's kind of against this also. So I just keep shifting up, up. But, so these two are going to Pershing Avenue in Orlando. I actually used to live in an apartment complex right off where this is, so I know exactly where this is going. They want me to go to Fort Myers with this. Pardon me? Oh, hello. Are you on a phone? No, 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 just. Oh. Quarter of it, you can say hi. Hey, what up, man? Is this a private owned business here? Ah, uh, yes, sir. Transporting? Yes. It's mine. I have a dually. Oh, you do? Yeah, but I don't have a. Do I need one of these? Yeah, yeah. Let me, let me finish this off and then we'll talk to you. So this, this guy is 6,000 pounds, and of course, he put it all the way front. He's, I said, how much that way? He said, 500. Yeah, dude, that's four numbers, not three. 5,900, so I am going to shoot to Miami and get this off my truck, then go to Fort Myers, which is on the west coast today, does the state, and then dead head home to Orlando. Yeah, so there we go. I actually used to live right there. Granted, it was a decade ago, but... Yeah, and the company that I was a partner of, we actually kind of ran the place. So, moved out of there into my house, and here is the drop. Turn left onto Wild Horse Road. Oh, you see. That's where all my money's been going all these years. But, drop number, I guess it'll be four now. Well, I really hope the trailer doesn't swing and hit that. That would just make my day. Week, month, whatever you want to call it. Let's see how this goes. It's a little intimidating, right? Like, <laughs> power poles. Big old chunk of concrete. We're gonna swing it as wide as possible. Yeah. Do, do, do. 
better. Come on, baby. Oh yeah, whippies. Did you hear me? I'm gonna have you sign one on the clipboard and then that one for us. All right. Logan. What's that? Logan. Ah, uh, I got a YouTube channel. Number four, gone. Five, six, but we're doing six, five. Like we said, get the heavy one off the truck first. And it's a smoother shot down the turnpike for me. <sighs> Frustrated, I could be home in 10 minutes right now, man. Like 10 minutes with a Corona on my back porch. Instead, Heading down to South Florida. Here we go. If you're ever in Orlando and you're about to get on 528, 40, 36, do not go to that place for gas. Look at their gas prices. Their whole business model is getting people with rental cars before they return them going back to the airport. So their gas price is constantly $6 and over. It's been like that for years. Bunch of shysters. I can't believe they actually make money, but whatever but yeah sun gas go ahead and pass so this uh the receiver down in miami doesn't go past three o'clock no way i'm gonna make it there so looks like i'm gonna have to wait another day before i can uh, quarter mile. go ahead Turn and right onto drop the my load you know it's been six months six weeks so i got a receiver waiting for me but yeah, I guess it's another day. If you can understand all the innuendos in that, then right under the Florida you're my type of person. Thank you. Have a good night. Thank you. What's going on, Not much, brother. How are you? All right. We got one more stop down here, man. Uh, let's head over to uh, our big fat Stop five, complete. Uno mas. Then cerveza. But, trucks. Yeah, I almost got myself run over. He wasn't happy with me. <laughs> but the truck is happy. We got 6,000 pounds off of there instead of dragging it all the way across the state again. So that's another reason I wanted to do this drop first. So, here we go. Morning, what we got left. Um, because the uh, oil, I was having issues with the, with the hub over there on the other side. Um, I decided to do the lift axle. and actually got like eight, 8.5 MPG all the way here, which is really good for me. So, yeah, man. Uh, but I'm gonna start today with a rant. Look at this. Garbage, garbage. There's a garbage can right flipping there. What is that? 50 feet? Like, y'all like living in sh trash everywhere? See that? I almost swore and I didn't. But come on, man. Like, <laughs> just put it in the damn can. I don't want to look at your trash. Yeah, if you want to, if 
you want to clean up this world, you got to start with yourself. So, coffee, I already have my other two morning routines. <laughs> and here we go, and then we're off to Orlando, and we are home. <clears throat> and I will cheers you all with a Corona in about four and a half hours. So, see ya. Load six, done. Now we're going home. Well, we made it home and important work has begun. <sighs> Sending in the last batch of BOLs and yeah. So what we're gonna do is, I think we're gonna pack the trailer house with grease and paint all the rims, get rid of all the rust, paint them all black so it looks a little bit better and we don't have more rust happening back there. And my brakes were squeaking on the truck so probably gonna do a full brake job in the next 10 days or however long I'm home. So thanks for watching everyone and we will see you soon.